Hello everybody, friends of Fanport Town with you back again as my cell phone says 10.52 p.m. on Tuesday, August 17th, 2021. First recipe of the night. This is rather different from Gooseberry Patch's Church Suppers, Soup, Suppers, and Chili Cook-Offs. This is House of Bulls Chili from Shirley Bowles of Wyoming, Delaware. She worked a night shift in a large nursing room for 16 years, and whenever it was her turn to bring an entree for a potluck, she always would bring the chill this chili. The first night she brought in, someone had written the recipe down. I have to copy on my desk, so I would always make it the same. Yeah. You need a teaspoon of oil, or a tablespoon of oil, whatever it is. One green pepper chopped. One onion chopped. Two pounds of either ground beef, ground chicken, or ground turkey. That part's up to you. Two one and a quarter packages of cheese and chili seasoning mix. Two, two four town cans of stewed tomatoes and you crush them. You can, you can do it with your hands. That would be the easiest way to do it. A 12 ounce can of tomato paste and two 15 ounce cans of kidney beans drained and rinsed. Now they can be Bush's brand, Goya brand, any brand canned beans you can find. But remember, you have to drain and rinse them because you don't want any of the bean liquid in there. That wouldn't make a great chili. No, it wouldn't. Alright, so what you do now is heat oil in a large skillet over medium heat. You saute the pepper and the onion just until it's tender. And you add your ground meat, which uh, that means if you're using ground beef, chicken, or turkey, you can use an 80% lean ground beef. That would be fine. For ground turkey, you want to get the one with the dark meat because it has more flavor and won't dry out. For the ground chicken, you can pick any ground chicken that you want. Then you cook it all until it's brown, then you drain it. Add your remaining ingredients, stirring well, and of course, you do have to pour this in your slow cooker. That's where it comes in handy. Cover and cook it on low setting for about 6 to 8 hours. In that time, you can do anything. My guess is probably read a book, watch a movie, watch TV, talk on the phone, be on the computer, whatever you like. And this one serves six to eight. Now this is a great church supper, House of Bulls Chili by Shirley Bulls of Wyoming, Delaware, who was kind enough to give us this recipe. Thank you so much, and there's going to be another recipe coming up, so stay tuned for that one, and don't go away.